That, I, I'm ready for the era where Vivi is like peaceful and like a little bit like tranquil even. Till they who? I don't know. Sinji who? I don't know. Yeah, all right. Getting into this game though. Gonna game one's gonna be on Smashville. Very interesting. So, oh, what's happening? Where, what? Uh, 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 sure. Uh, yeah. So one thing, actually, these two played in winners, and one thing about it is that uh, he looks for bounce. That's one thing I was about to say. That bounce makes such a difference, and then it's really cool to see how Sinji changes up his playstyle once bounce comes into effect, because then he starts using Pac-Man's honestly pretty solid boxing tools. However, uh. It becomes a lot scarier to use boxing tools when he also has psych up. Bounce immediately again. He, the, finally, the RNG is working out in his favor. Period. But <gasps> that RNG oh, is not looking like... He needs zoom. Like, he oh, finds wow. it. Wow. Never mind. The RNG is working plentifully well for him. I don't know. Yeah, he was dead if that oh, zoom didn't no, come up. <laughs> now he's dead. Bye. Yeah. Period. Oh. Let's see what Sinji can do oh, with a oh. lead. 35% uh, in the blink of an eye, apparently. Oh, period. Hello? <laughs> you I'm think... Oh. No, it's okay. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> Unless you want me to say period again. Period. <laughs> Not even gonna kill, but period. Yeah, oh, but psych up now. This is so scary. Sinji's... Yeah, he gets hit by the mix. If it lands, he's done. Uh... Oh, I think you are right that actually Psych Up is the one that lasts longer. Uh, so I'm, I'm stupid and don't remember things. Uh, but anyway. Whoa. Man, all of Hero's stuff just looks so devastating. And I'm actually surprised he threw that out there. I think that costs a decent amount of MP. He's kind of low on things right now. Oh, very low actually now and trapped in the corner. And even though he might not necessarily just be straight up dying from no MP, when he is trapped at the ledge and, oh, if he gets, yeah, good stuff. But uh, when he's trapped at the ledge and then all, you know, Sinji can just rinse, recycle, repeat, keep him there if he knows he doesn't have the MP to really mix up things that well. Absolutely, and getting back to, you know, the ledge, this is really where we've seen Vivi struggle. I'm gonna be completely honest. I don't know what it is about Sinji, but he's, he's doing something. All right, good throw. We'll put Sinji at the ledge. Once more bounce in effect. And I like the fact that when bounce is there, Sinji just stops messing around with projectiles. Doesn't even bother charging it. Doesn't want to give it to the... Oh! Um, uh, I can't wait for... Uh, what? Um, but he, he was, no, he was there. Yes. He's dead. No. Did you could have killed if he had known that that wasn't gonna hit? I think he could have gone for like side B maybe. Oh oh oh! I don't know what that beam was, but that zoom is gonna absolutely help. Wow, that was looking a little scary. I don't know. Is we gonna get anything? <gasps> oh god, he's you, double you. buffed. I don't know what it was, BB. Oh Vivi. he. Find zoom once again. I swear that's not a hundred percent zoom chance if you uh, if you're out there. Uh, do you, does anyone know the exact statistics? Maybe we can find that out later. Uh, for zoom while you're in the blast zone, doesn't quite matter in the end since he picks up the stock regardless. Uh, but 59. Honestly, a pretty decent chunk, especially considering how early we've seen BB has the potential to kill at. Yeah, he's. I actually like this hanging on that platform, really looking for those uh for those buff moves so that he can maybe threaten the kill even. Absolutely, uh, and I'm gonna be honest too. We haven't really seen much, you know, like from BB, like being able to ledge trap, being able to like keep you know Sinji in more. Like even though he does, he did have the lead. It was really in a situation where it's just like a lot of the times it's not like Sinji's really struggling at ledge either. It's mostly like Vivi who's struggling at ledge. Vivi who's still trying to, you know, kind of gain yeah. a little bit more like comfortability when you have Pac-Man just doing Pac-Man things. <laughs> like, yeah. And also, I think it's worth noting that. Oh, oh, cute. Um, I think it's worth noting that I think when any of the besides that one thwack, all of Vivi's you know non-buff uh, down B specials have just not been landing. Which I realize that's a pretty big, you know, oh, ignoring, you know, the thwack that killed. Uh, but still, nonetheless, it does eat up a lot of MP. And right now, we're actually looking at a pretty low MP. Oh, he's actually... Oh, he's dead! Wow. Just gets right up into it. Yeah, you have to be mindful of the fact that that bell, it bounces. 
You're not the only one who has access to bounce. That bell does too. Bounce that bell, period. Hey, look at this. Good doing. I'm gonna be completely honest though. It would have hit ledge too. So like, what are you doing that? You can't, you can't uh, jump. You can't normal get up. You can't freaking. You can't um, what's it called? You can't roll because at that point, VV, I mean not um, VV, Cindy has to just react to you rolling and then you're dead. Yeah, I mean you can jump backwards, <laughs> but he was also low on MP. Yeah, no, that's a really tricky spot. Great job from Sinji recognizing how to set that situation up. Absolutely. And, oh. oh wow! Just wow! Mm, yes, juicy. Is she moving? I don't know. And still putting on damage, 72 percent. And barely contested. What's going on here? I mean, I think Sinji just kind of turning up. He's Turn doing up. what he needs to do. 90%. This is also, you know, this is BB, and he plays Lucario, so he's no stranger to being down by a lot and making comebacks happen. But the thing is, he has to get kind of some space in order to find, perhaps, you know, the specials to do it. That's going to be one of them. It's going to really help him avoid dying mainly, because you know most of Pac-Man's kill options require projectiles. Like Ooh. that, yeah. Like this, that's the exact situation that he died in that game too, in that game one, and that time around, having bounce kept him safe. I'm gonna be completely honest too. I feel like again, oh, oh. Ah! Oh. did he top deck that? What happened? I don't know. Oh. I'm gonna be completely honest though. Wow. Oh, um. <laughs> So, I'm going to be completely honest, though, um, it's kind of like the issue I'm also seeing is that Vivi it, it doesn't know how to stabilize the kind of MP usage, you know, like, always buffing himself up and not really getting the chance to actually do anything I mean, in return. I think it's like, you know, he kind of comes out pumping all, you know, full foot on the gas. And then, ooh, after that, you know, he kind of knows how to slow it down. We haven't really seen him, for the most part, struggle with his being low on MP. Well, as I say that right now, ooh, he's once more kind of, you know, teetering on the edge. Doesn't have access to that much. But he seems like he's, honestly, he's perfectly fine doing it. Oh, no, big damage? What was that? Oh, and that's absolutely going to kill. I feel like... The really good place that like Vivi has like some really threatening options and knows how to use it a lot of the time, but also like sometimes it's just not what he really needs. Like you know what I mean? Absolutely. He's still struggling. This is similar to what we saw earlier on. He's at 80% trapped at the ledge, and that's the counterplay. It gets him hit anyway. <laughs> oh yeah, he avoided the bell. Still gets hit by the down smash. I mean, I think it was preferable because it kept him at least on the stage. But, uh, oh man, Sinji with Bell in hand is just so scary. Sinji with Bell in hand, what will he do? Oh, but speaking of scary, that red aura is intimidating as hell. Oh, and yeah, bounce still in effect. Sinji doesn't have access to how he normally likes to get kills. He can't even bust the, uh, the hydrant on him. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, that was a really good roll onto stage. Vivi was not expecting it. Got him out of that bad situation. The question is whether or not... Oh, wait. Uh -huh. okay. <laughs> if that had landed, if that had landed, then that would have just been, you know, sex tuple brain giga play. All right, but, finally. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's absolutely going to do it. Now, we're looking at potentially Vivi's last stock of... The set, or is that the, the tournament. tournament? This could be Sorry. the end of the <laughs> tournament right here. Last stock for Vivi. He's worked so hard to make it all the way to grand finals, beating a bunch of really great players. Is he going to keep himself alive, though? That was a massive pickup that up tilt managing to do it. Already he's taken about 36%, though. The question is whether he can actually mount the full comeback. Sinji has felt like he's just been in control the entire time. But, oh, looks like maybe it's slipping away from him. He's done all this damage and he so conserved so much MP. Big bounce right there. That's going to prevent Sinji from going for a lot of his more uh, preferred Ooh. styles of play. At least for a little while. 
This is really looking scary for Senji right now because yeah, he can die. Yeah, no, real, real scary. Oh, he's dead if he gets hit at the ledge with another one of those moves. Wee-oo, wee-oo, wee-oo. <laughs> Sirens blaring in the background. Senji has to be so careful. All right, he still has the... I, was that the oomph? No, that, that is in fact the, uh, the psych up. It should expire soon. All right, there it goes. Sinji can breathe a little bit easier, but not necessarily feel that great. Still at 106%, still trapped at the ledge, running up and grabbing him, recognizing that Sinji is scared, hanging out in shield for just a little bit too long. And now at 128, he doesn't even need the buffs to be getting kills. Sinji has to be so careful. No. Very nice keeping, you know, kind of the stage. Oh, Bell once more in hand. The second that bounce expires, you know that Sinji's going to be trying to land it. He does. He goes for it, but it's actually the wrong time. Going really deep with that, he manages to dodge the Bell entirely. Forward air taking the stock. We now have a 1-1 game right now between these two. Absolutely. What do you... I don't know. That was very nice, you know, like, taking that final stock from Vivi. And I don't, I'm going to be completely honest. What do you think Vivi's going to do? Because, you know, it was a very much a nail-biter game. But now, if he wants to keep this, you know, going, he has to, like, really put in a lot of, like, you know, thought process onto how he's actually yeah. going to, you know, get a lead, keep the lead, especially against, like, City of all people. I think the other part of this is that you could see at the end of that last game, Sinji was playing scared. And Vivi is like, you know, considering the fact he plays Lucario normally, he absolutely knows how to feed off of your fear. He takes your fear and turns it into just a, a life force that us mere mortals can't even begin to comprehend. So you're, what you're saying is that Vivi's a demigod. Uh, he's a demogorgon, dude. Demogumbelo. <laughs> he's a Doug Demidor. <laughs> Doug Demidor. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> That's crazy because it's looking. Oh, that was so cool! And it didn't kill. I don't know. Maybe he's trying to defeat the. <laughs> oh, whoa, whoa! That like despawned right in time. That could have been so scary. Oh, wow. And just trying to land. This I, I, this might be the scariness that we're talking about because it's looking like maybe he's trying to completely obliterate this dog. Okay, does Sinji keep track of how long. Uh, he must keep track of how long bounces because as soon as he sees it. He like wait. He throws out these projectiles right as it's about to end, which is honestly, as far as like things to learn, that's a really important one because the the opponent, BB, is probably expecting. You know, he's like, I'm not gonna get hit by a projectile because I have bounce in effect. But if you're able to time it perfectly, you can hit them with it before they can readjust what they need to be playing around. Absolutely, and. Another thing to that, I really feel like BB is trying to prioritize all of his movement buffs, but along with that, he's still running in without his movement buffs. So he has a really good situations where he wants to use Zap or the other oh, wait, oh, oh, oh. He's alive. He's alive somehow. It's Pac-Man. He's alive. Anyways, like he's he still needs a lot of those situations to kind of happen where he's not just running in without those buffs because. You know, it ends up in a situation where you're off stage again like that, and you're really, like, you know, down by this much. Yeah, I will say that at these lower percents, or like when he first respawns, he spends a lot of MP, like, using a big spell to destroy Hydra. Well, I mean, I guess he's gonna. Yeah. Are you not, like. I can't believe Sinji is managing to dodge all of those so consistently. No jump off stage. Sinji's going to go for the down air. Okay, yeah, this is similar to what we saw before. He goes for down air, but specifically because it gives him the opportunity to still go for a trump if Vivi isn't careful. Oh, 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 okay, going to put him right back off stage. Trying to get these buffs up and just wait. It's going to kill him with a sword. Just all right. One. Yeah, I believe that, as far as I've been tracking it, I think Bounce lasts for 12 seconds. Uh, and so I, I really do think that Sinji just pays attention and is making sure to actually, you know, punish him as soon as it despawns. Oh, that was a very nice Tomahawk right there. <laughs> oh, look at all of the movement! And he's dead. Here <laughs> he did all that Naruto running all over the place just to get grabbed. Here he is. Hello? Like... I don't, I don't want to deal with that bell in hand no more than, like, BB wants to deal with that bell in hand. I'm trying to get that bell going. I don't know. 
Man, I'm, I'm sorry, but Thwack looks like a Zygote invader. Well. <laughs> Shout out to anybody who would uh, understand what I'm trying to say when I say that. I don't understand what anyone's trying to say, I'm just completely honest. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what I do understand? VV is trying to live. He does not want to deal with any of this messy... Um, well, that also happened, but anyway. No way! What a snipe! What a... How? How did he know? That was so good! Sinji managing to get the kill off that zoom? Are you kidding me? Oh, no. Oh, no. And, okay, bounce once more in effect. I like the fact that as soon as bounce comes online, also, Sinji just puts it back in his pocket. Here. You can't, you can't overshoot just yet. Look at oh. this. Oh, big damage possibly extended even more. Vivi's been trapped off stage, taken 71%. Is he dead from that? He more than is. And that's going to be it. Sinji winning the entire bracket is going to be your Xeno champion for this week. Period. <laughs> Exclamation point. Absolutely. I don't know what you're talking about. Point. Mitch, exclamation oh. point Maturino in the Here. chat. If you want to give extra award for Sinji for doing an amazing bell snipe like that, that was incredible. If you want to reward him just a little bit more, you can do it by typing in exclamation point Maturino in the chat, and it will just add 30 cents. Follow the instructions, adds 30 percent uh, 30 cents to the prize pool. Yeah, oh. he ran into that. Why he why he do that? It bounces. Gotta remember it bounces. Oh, no. It be bouncy. I'm sad. What do you mean you're sad? No, it was honestly I, hype play from Sinji. He totally deserves it. Worked so hard. He'd been losing to VV and Numbers specifically all week. And he comes back and he manages to beat both of them. Double eliminating VV in order to uh, win the entire tournament. Okay, listen.